guys and welcome back to my channel and for those of you who are new here my name's Ellen and welcome to my channel. So Oh Polly has dropped so many collections recently. We've had the Witch in Hour one, we've had the Egg and Sue one, we've had Havana, we've had Utopia I think is the most recent one and I haven't shopped at Oh Polly in ages and ages I think it must be going on a year now, I don't know, it's been a long, long time. So I thought we'd shop at Oh Polly. Literally, this feels so weird having a smaller bag as this, because I'm pretty sure the last time I shopped at Oh Polly, I had a box, like, massive, massive box. I'm pretty sure that was the last time I shopped at Oh Polly. But, yeah, I've got a little bag. I bought six items today, which is five outfits. So yeah, let's just jump straight into it. So the first thing that I got, and I've got to say this feels so, so silky smooth, was this long sleeve mesh corset detail dress in navy. This just looks absolutely gorgeous. It feels so, so soft, like so soft. It's got a little bit of stretch to it, which is really nice. And it comes in with a built-in bra in the corset. And it's also got, which I really like, is that rubber band on the top of the sleeve, just so they won't move, which I really, really like that. But this just looks gorgeous. And as you know, I'm loving mesh at the moment. I'm not too fussed on corsets, I've got to be honest. But this just looks so flipping gorgeous. And I love blue as well. This just looks amazing. I love this already. And this one was £55. I absolutely adore this dress. It's so comfortable. It's so soft. It's just so beautiful. But the only thing is, there's two problems I have found with this. I'm looking in the mirror as well. I've got a mirror like set up opposite me. It's that the sleeves are very, very long. And literally, if I want it so it's not like creased, I would literally have to have them like this. And don't get me wrong, I do like having my sleeves over my hands sometimes. I think it's just a comfort thing. But this is just a bit too long for me. The fit of this is just beautiful. I absolutely adore it. It feels so soft. It feels so comfortable. It doesn't feel like it's very restrictive or anything like that. And I love the rubber on the top of the sleeves just to stop the sleeves from moving. I feel like that is really nice as well. And I feel like without it, it would probably slip down. And the other thing as well is that so I said it comes with its own cuts, it comes with its own moulding around here. However, for those in the itty bitty titty committee like I am, they are too big to fill. And I kind of feel like it looks a bit weird, like it looks nice on, but I'm very aware that I can feel I'm not filling it, I'm not... I don't know, I feel a bit too small for this. Next then I got a cowl sleeve midi dress in Sage. This one once again looks absolutely gorgeous feels so so silky smooth i love this so you've got the straps obviously for your shoulders and then you've got the sleeves by here the straps are adjustable i love adjustable straps so that'll be lovely and you've got like a cowl front as well you zip it up at the back and it's a midi dress and then at the back as well right at the bottom you've got like a mini slit just by here but this, honestly, these just feel so, so soft. I actually adore these. And it also feels like wedding guest dresses, like that type of vibe. I really like these. Like, these just feel so, I don't know if sophisticated is the right word or just a bit more elegant. It feels just a bit more elegant and because it's so silky soft as well, I think that just adds to the elegance and I really, really love this. This is just... Oh my gosh, I'm gonna, I think I love this haul already. This is only two items in and I already love it and I feel like that's dangerous, but we're gonna go for it. So I'm gonna try this one on now and it was 50 pounds. I am going to a wedding in 2024. I know that's a long way off, but I feel like this could be the dress for it. Like this is absolutely gorgeous. Can you see the little split at the back? This is phenomenal. I thought it might wash out my colour a little bit, but I don't think it does. And I really like it and I think the colours of the wedding are green and yellow because that's the colours they like. So I think, I think this could be the dress. This is absolutely gorgeous. I love the cowl sleeves, I love the cowl neck at the front. I do feel like I probably would have to tighten the straps just to get that little extra bit of security around the front. However, I do absolutely adore this dress. This is actually gorgeous. Next then I got the one shoulder cutout mini dress in aqua. I this is a little bit out of my comfort zone. This one was £52 by the way. This one is a little bit out of my comfort zone. And it's already a bit thready on the strap, the one that goes, you've got like your shoulder strap and then the one that I the crossover one. And this one is a little bit thready already. It was already wrapped in um, 
tissue paper this bit on its own just to keep it extra protected but it does come a little bit thready. This one is a little bit out of my comfort zone because it's cut out. However, the colour is just phenomenal. I absolutely adore the colour. Like, this is just gorgeous. So, so pretty. And the straps are adjustable as well, once again. So that is extra points there for me. It's quite a heavy dress, but I feel like it's just quite thick, to be honest. This one, once again, is gorgeous, but I feel like... The bottom fits quite nicely, apart from this bit right here, which is quite loose. But then, this bit, I feel a bit weird, like, I feel like it should be up a bit more. And that bit by there, and that's how it should look, maybe. But once again, itty bitty tissue committee, so we do not fill this as it's meant to be filled. But I do really like this, it's actually really gorgeous. It's the colour. I adore the colour. I really... It's just blue, this is just aqua, it's beautiful, it's such a gorgeous piece and I love the Diamantes going across here. And I'm not really a one shoulder type of gal, but this could convince me. I did think it was a bit outside of my comfort zone, but I actually don't feel too out there in it. It looks gorgeous, I would wear this on the night out I would say, but I don't know. It's beautiful, it's such a gorgeous dress, like maybe for like a friend's birthday or for like my birthday night out, maybe I would wear this. But once again, I feel like I need to kind of fill these up a bit more to be able to do that. And I don't think there's a way you can wear a bra with this, to be honest, unless you kind of keep that there, maybe put a strapless one on. But still, I feel like that would ruin the vibe. So the next two pieces I got were this black maxi side split skirt. This is gorgeous, and I didn't realise it's got a bit of ruching down the one side as well, down the side with the split. This is absolutely gorgeous, once again, in the softest, like, silkiest material ever. It feels so, so nice. And it's kind of got a bit of a V front. Yeah, it's got ruching on the one side and a bit of a V front, I would say. And this one fastens on the side with a zip and then it's got an eyelet hook on the top as well. This one was £36. Then to go with that, I got this cowl neck corset top. And this one was £46. This one actually really confused me for a second because... So, the straps have got, like, these jewels on them, which looks gorgeous once again. It's just extra, extra, just a little bit of extra glam, you know? And it just looked really nice. But I couldn't remember what it looked like on the picture. So there's... The gems are going all the way down here. And then it cuts through the cowl neck at the front to come out the bottom. And I was like, oh my god, is it damaged? Am I, like, is it already just broken or something but I think it's meant to be like that. I looked at the picture and I'm pretty sure it's meant to be like that. So this is the top. I was kind of hoping that I wasn't going to level these pieces because I cannot afford to level these pieces. But I love all these pieces. This is actually so so pretty. Oh my gosh. And even the top. I wasn't sure if I was going to love the top because like I said I don't really... Fa I'm not a massive fan of corset tops. But I love this one as well. It's so comfortable once again. It's so pretty. It's so soft. It's so comfortable. I really love this and I was right the skirt does have like this V thing going on which I've seen a lot of the V's going on at the moment but this is just oh my gosh it's so pretty and then the final dress the one that I was most excited about I love to leave the best till last but this one I'm so so excited to try on it's a backless halter mini dress and it's in navy once again it just looks so beautiful on the website and I just, oh my gosh, the model did it so much justice. It looks gorgeous. I absolutely love this. So you tie, it's got two ties for the halter neck and then another two ties for the back. But I thought this would be really nice on holiday, like going out for if you're like on the beach having an evening meal or something. I feel like it'll just be gorgeous. And this one was £45 and I'm so excited to try it on. So I will try it on for you now. I don't actually like this one too much. I thought I was going to love it, but... I don't know, I feel like it gives Tinkerbell kind of vibes, like if it was in green, or I don't know what the water fairy is called, I can't remember her name, but that kind of vibe, but I don't know, it is a nice dress, don't get me wrong, but I don't like this bit right here, like, I don't really know how it should sit, but it doesn't feel like it's sitting properly. I was very excited for this dress as well, because I think this is the one I was like, right, this is why we're going for the collection, like, it sounds weird, every time I do a haul for a collection, it's always because I've seen one piece in that collection that I'm like, I need you. And this, for me, was that I need you dress. There was another one, a green one, but that was going to be my Tinkerbell dress, but that one was out of stock. Uh, 
this was the one that I was like, oh my god, that just looks gorgeous. I've seen so many people wearing something like this. I think there's one similar in Zara, and I was like, it just looks so, so pretty. But it just doesn't look pretty on me. I don't really like this. It kind of, it does give that, like, fairy vibes, though, because of the cut of the skirt. I really like it, but not on myself. So thank you all so much for watching my video. I hope you did enjoy. If you did, don't forget to like and subscribe down below. And let me know if you liked any of the outfits, if you agree with my choices. I love this collection. It's so beautiful and just feels so elegant. I I just love it. I just It's so soft. And I will see you all again soon. Stay safe and stay healthy. Bye.